Right then guys, hello and welcome to Pokemon 3D. Uh, we are back here, I can't even remember what, what route it was, I think it was like Route 36 or something like that. I don't think there's too much left of the game. Um, I'm just going to check who's out front here. I think there's like a few bits and pieces left to do, uh, but there's not overly too much to be done. But I'm going to carry on playing it as much as I can do until they go up to a brick wall basically. Uh, Thanks to my studies, I'm ready for any Pokemon. Okay, Schoolboy Allen is here. Sorry, I was a bit slow saying that. <laughs> it's late at night. Didn't manage to get up with the um, the episode of Glazed earlier. I managed to become Mergy Yoshi. Oh, this is perfect. So we got a Tangler out here. I'm just going to use some Flame Wheel loving on this guy. <sighs> Surprised I didn't actually knock him out in one hit. But hey ho, that's the way the cooker crumbers. Ten points to anybody who can figure out what film that's from. Right, just getting comfortable in my chair there. Alright then, so Tangler is down. Growly gets some decent XP, but it doesn't do much because Growly's a bitch to um, level up. So Schoolboy Allen was defeated. He only had one Pokemon. Okay, so I think this is basically it. I think um, we can actually get the Spray Bottle to do the Pseudo Budo event. It's a weird looking tree, and I think I'm going to actually catch him. So I'm just going to uh, go back and see what I can do. Um, I think there's actually the shortcut back into the city here. Yeah, there is. And I think there's a few trainers down there which I need to battle as well. So we can use cut here. Cut down tree. Yes, I want to use cut. Oh, crap. What Pokemon are out here? I think it's like Nidoran and stuff like that. Oh, random ditto. I'm just going to run from the ditto here and uh, get in the way of this guy. There we go. Right, I'll go anywhere if bug Pokemon appear there. Okay, I don't know if there's any bug Pokemon in this patch of grass, so I think you're about out of your way there, but... Uh, so we got Growly getting on here, and... Venonat is going to get a taste of my... McLovin Flame Wheel, son. And it's a one-hit kill on Venonat. That is sweet as fuck. Right, so... We... Just killed him. Oh. What's with all these bloody Pokemon trainers with the only one hit shit? Alright, um, so we got them guys down there which we've already beaten. So I'm just going to go through here, purely because I can. I'm not going to battle anything if it comes up. Okay, I didn't know they did Yamnas around here. That's pretty cool. I do like Yamnas. They, I, I think they're the most interesting bug Pokemon to look at. Oh, we got a... What do we have here? A hoot hoot. Well, I don't give a hoot hoot hoot. If I gave a hoot, I'd catch you hoot hoot hoot. Alright, so we got this trainer guy here. There we go. So, fingers crossed he puts up a better battle than the other guys. What kind of Pokeballs do you use? Bird Keeper Brian. So, he's a bird type battler, I guess. Let me guess he's going to have like a shit ton of Pidgey. Yep. What a guess. <laughs> it wasn't hard to guess that as soon as Pidgey's the main bird Pokemon for this game. So, we're gonna get a, oh, we're gonna get a Pidgeotto, are we? No, I'm gonna keep Growly out here, so let's get Flame Wheel going. You just got a taste of the Flame Wheel loving, and you did not like it. It's gonna have one more hit on him, and he should be down. There we go, look at that. Look at that, he ate that dust. So, Growly's come back, it's only two Pokemon, and it wasn't all too hard. I kind of miss uh, the Mill Tank now, <laughs> where actually it was a massive challenge for me to beat him. Um, okay, so we got a little little present down here. We got a little, I think it's a Paralyzed Hero, yes it is. I should know my medicine, Jesus. So I'm just going to carry on going around here. Oh, and look, it's a dead end. Well, that sucks, because that means we've got to go back around. Right, so I'm going to go try and get that spray bottle now, so that's why I'm back here. I'm pretty sure it's around here where I have to go, and it's in there. Here we go, is it this girl? Oh, you're better than Whitney. Oh, didn't catch that. If you use the scroll ball, you should be okay. Right, okay, so we are going to go screw the pseudo widow up. Alright, so I'm going to actually just talk to this girl here as well. Do you know the moon tree? What are you doing so surprising? Okay, well, I'm going to go heal my Pokemon and we're going to go kill that jumping tree, I guess. Right then guys, I'm back at the pseudo-wudo, and 
I'm actually gonna save here because uh, I really want to catch a pseudo wudo, pseudo wudo, pseudo wudo, and add him to our party because that'd be pretty cool to have a pseudo wudo. Use a squad bottle. So you're gonna use a squad bottle. Um, I'm guessing this is the this is the bit where it actually splits off to uh, go to Equal Teak City, um, which would be pretty cool. Uh, Cause that's where the EVs are at, I think. I can't even remember. It's been a long time since I played this game, so I'm just gonna start with Bite. I mean, I know Pseudo Weirdo's a pretty hard Pokemon, and he's gonna keep using Copycat, but it's a placeholder at the moment because it's not actually. The, I don't think the move's actually been set up. Uh, same with Flail. Um, kind of annoying, seeing as I want to add him to my team. And none of his Pokemon actually, uh, the moves actually work. But I reckon they will by next, uh, next time the updates come out. So, oh no, what am I doing? I am trying to go for a great ball. Let's see if Pseudo Wudo wants to be caught. Nope, doesn't want to be caught. Let's try a Pokeball this time. See if that's any different to a great ball. Then again, I have caught legendaries with a normal Pokeball before. It doesn't really matter. I s swear the chances of catching it aren't any different between Pokeballs. Seeing as you can get like 3 for the price of... No, you can get f like 12 for the price of one Master Ball. So I, I f think that's why most people are able to catch them with uh, Pokeballs. It's because you can get so many of them. And just can't seem to get anything on them. Uh... And I haven't got any Pokemon that can do status effects, but I... Uh, I don't want to kill him! Will that kill him? That will kill him. Yes. Right. Oh, and that got Growly up to level 20 as well. Ah, uh, shit. Alright. I don't think I'm going to try that again. Purely because... Well, I don't want to go through that crap. And... Oh, it looks like we have another route to investigate. Let's see what this says. Yeah, I just can't bother to go back and catch it. I mean, it, I was thinking about it, but then, kind of, when I got into a battle with it, because it doesn't have the moves, and it kind of bugs me a little bit, but, oh wow, it's alright. Let's, let's.
because okay so obviously I was gonna kill him anyway no matter what it was unless it wasn't effective okay that still didn't do overly too much um let's try a takedown see how that does and a faint oh faint attack so that Clefairy is gonna be down no matter what John. sorry